Toastmasters? Are there any guests? I don't think so. Setting up a two-tier channel in a theatre, that's not the job of an AT analyst. The email from a senior manager seemed to scream at me. Well, I had been working with Japan, theatre stakeholders, trying to convince them that setting up a two-tier distribution channel was their solution to some of the very, very tremendous problems that they faced in their channel model. I was making headway. I'm convinced I was making headway. But there was a tremendous amount of work that was still before me, before Japan accepted, established, and leveraged to tier distribution. And my manager, or this senior manager who was advising me to cease and desist, was trying to hide me from abject failure to cool my order. Well, for me it was like cold water bringing me to senses. When I considered this email, I thought to myself, this manager knows the industry much better than me. He is much more senior to me. His advice has to be impeccable. I lost sleep over this. Should I be disengaging from Japan? But eventually, I took stock of what I had. Well, I had a few things going in favor of me. The first thing was the knowledge of distribution systems and processes, which was probably second to none. Secondly, I had a lot of sensitivity, influence, and relationship with, the, with my stakeholders in Japan. But ever more, I had a fire burning within me to make a difference for the theater. So I continued to chip away. And eventually, even though it took me about three quarters to do it, we managed to bring Japan on more distribution processes. We established it, we are leveraging it now. I mentioned this incident because I wanted to remind you folks of a few things. First of all, don't let people tell you what you can do or what you cannot do. Don't let them put you in a box. Don't let them draw boundaries around you. Human beings have immense potential. That means you. That means you. It means you. As Vice President of Education, I come across a lot of our club members who sometimes are assigned with self-doubt. Can I give an effective public speech? Can I be the Toastmaster of the day? Can I really manage a meeting? Can I evaluate, motivate? My answer would be invariably, yes, you can. You can do this. Don't let other people tell you that you cannot. Don't let yourself down. Don't paint yourself within boundaries. I went through this, a moment of self-realization, when I thought to myself, yes, I can. And I'm sure all of you will have the same experience. And that moment really transcends giving a good public speech. It allows you, that moment allows you to really take a deep peek inside you and realize who you are. Thank you.